pyramid. Assistant Sub-Inspector Anita Kumari Vivi leads the formation and the national tricolor proudly unfurled as the Desh Ke Rakshak move gently past. So we now move from diligently practiced gravity-defying moves on the ground to exciting gravity-defying maneuvers in the air. And if you've loved every minute of what you've witnessed so far, then do ask for more. Flight pass ka control abhi aapne dekha. Colonel P.P. Vishwas ke nitritu mein one air formation signal regiment jo Bharati Vayu Sena ke adbhut aur adhutiye fly past ke control ke liye sanchar pradhan kar rahi hai. So everybody, eyes skywards as we watch the first formation from the fly past, the Trishul, three ALH helicopters in VIC formation. For the first time, a tri-services formation is taking part in the Republic Day. Flying at a speed of 180 kilometers per hour, led by Group Captain Abhishek Shukla, commanding officer 116 helicopter unit. The caption of the helicopter, the captain, is Lieutenant Colonel Atul Srivastav. The Navy helicopter was flown by Commander Ajay Yadav and the indigenously denied produced in India. And after that, there are three Chinook helicopters in the WIC formation. The first time the Chinook helicopters in the Gantantra Divas Parade. The group captain Siddharth Rawat in the command. The other two helicopters in the wing commander Rahul Sharma and the wing commander Prashant Unyad. The speed of 180 km and the speed of 100 km. Formation leader is Group Captain Sadar Dravat, commanding of the 126 helicopter flight. The other formation members are Wing Commander Rahul Sharma and Wing Commander Prashant. The excitement building up in the crowd as the fly past is well on its way. The next formation will be comprising five state of the art precision attack Apache helicopters. They have provided the Indian Armed Forces a significant edge against the enemy in the battlefield. The formation will be led by Group Captain Mannat Shailu, Commanding Officer 125 Helicopter Squadron. The captains of the other four helicopters are Group Captain Ashok Kumar, Wing Commander Kshitij Avasthi, Wing Commander Indumit Singh and Wing Commander Praveen Sarathi. Versatile helicopter capable of firing air to air and air to ground missiles. I spread my wings and I will always fly high. I do want to take film I stuff. Apache helicopters in a hal hime by Usiname Shamil Kiagahe or up. Dornier Formation, Wing Commander S.K. Chauhan ke netritu mein teen Dornier Viman, Wig Formation mein yahaan se guzrenge, ye maal wahak jahaz hain, aur anne do vimano mein hoonge, Squadron Leader Vikas Kumar, aur Squadron Leader Abhishek Vashisht, sab ki nigaan hain, ek baar phir Rashtrapati Bhavan ki or Akash mein. Excitement galore at the Republic Day Parade right now. There is speed, there is pulse racing daring, and there is precision, all thanks to these daredevil men in blue. And for these men in blue of the Indian Air Force, the blue sky seems to be an extension of them as they take wing and vanish into the blue. Behind the Dornier, we will soon see the Hercules formation comprising three C-130J Super Hercules aircraft in VIC formation. Inducted into the Indian Air Force in 2011, the Super Hercules is a very versatile tactical transport aircraft optimized for special operations. It has gained fame for its high altitude operations Led by Group Captain V.P. Singh, the formation will be flying 300 meters above ground 
at a speed of 350 kilometers per hour. The other two aircraft will be captained by Wing Commander Shishir Sukhan and Wing Commander HPS Bharti. बेहद रोमांचक यहाँ दर्शकों में अपने स्थान पर खड़े होकर इस फ्लाई पास्ट का आनंद लेते हुए और हरक्यूलिस के बाद नेत्र फॉर्मेशन हरक्यूलिस फॉर्मेशन अभी आपने देखी थी और अब नेत्र यानी आकाश में नेत्र ये एयरबॉन अर्ली वार्निंग एंड कंट्रोल सिस्टम से लैस एयरक्राफ्ट है इस सिस्टम को डीआरडीओ ने स्वदेश में ही निर्मित किया है ये रेडार सिस्टम 400 किलोमीटर की दूरी से ही शत्रु के विमान का पता लगाकर उसे नष्ट करने का निर्देश दे सकता है इस विमान के दोनों तरफ सुखोए थर्टी एम के आई विमान उड़ते हुए ए ईडब्ल्यू एंड सी विमान ग्रुप कैप्टन प्रदीप बत्रा उड़ा रहे हैं और सुखोए थर्टी एम के आई विमानों में विंग कमांडर जी चौहान और विंग कमांडर उत्कर्ष सिंह A lovely clear day for a perfect fly past. And now we look skywards for the globe formation, comprising three C-17 Globemaster flying in displaced trail wick formation at a speed of 500 kilometers per hour. The C-17 is a heavy lift, long-range strategic aircraft inducted into the Indian Air Force in 2014. The induction of the C-17 aircraft has changed the dynamics of strategic mobility and reach of the Indian Air Force. Be it humanitarian operations or rapid mobilization for civil aid, the C-17 aircraft has always been there at the forefront. The C-17 aircraft being captained by Group Captain P. C. Sodia, Group Captain Rakesh Sharma, and Wing Commander Karan Kapoor. ये सभी विमान देश के अलग अलग शहरों वायुसेना के अलग अलग एयरबेसिस से उड़कर यहां पहुंचे हैं कमाल का कोऑर्डिनेशन और अब पांच जैगवार विमान तीर की शक्ल में यानी एरोहेड फॉर्मेशन में यहां से गुजरेंगे ग्रुप कैप्टन पारिजात सौरभ की कमान में अन्य विमानों में होंगे विंग कमांडर अर्जारिया विंग कमांडर गौतम स्कॉड लीडर गिल और फ्लाइट लेफ्टिनेंट चंदेल इन जैगवार विमानों की रफ्तार 780 किलोमीटर प्रति घंटे की Over the years the fly past has grown to become one of the major highlights of the parade a wondrous high to conclude a spectacular show of military strength and cultural diversity and now we look forward to the fulcrum arrowhead formation following the jaguars 5 mig 29 upgrade air superiority fighters in arrowhead formation the mig 29 upg aircraft will be flying in formation have been recently upgraded led by group captain alok sharma the other members of the formation wing commander parijat jha wing commander ab vasane wing commander amol kelkar and squadron leader arun bala subramaniam raftar badhti hui romanch badhta hua aur ab teen sukhoi 30 mki त्रिशूल फॉर्मेशन में सलामी मंच के ऊपर से गुजरेंगे आकाश में त्रिशूल कैसे बनता है ये अब हम सब देखेंगे इस फॉर्मेशन की कमान संभाली है ग्रुप कैप्टन निशित ओहरी ने बाकी दो विमानों में विंग कमांडर नीलेश दीक्षित और विंग कमांडर करण डोगरा Absolutely spectacular, and now peeling off in three different directions. The Trishul formation in the sky. And now, ladies and gentlemen, 
And now a befitting salute to the motto of the Indian Air Force. Nabhas Parsham Deeptam, the brilliance that rose to the sky. We will see a lone Sukhoi 30 MKI flying at a speed of 900 kilometers per hour that will split the sky with a vertical charlie. In this aerobatic maneuver, the aircraft does a high speed run at a low level and then pulls up into a vertical climb and then performs quick rolls to one side. Wing Commander Yatharth Johri along with Flight Lieutenant S. Mishra. ये हैरत अंगेज कर देने वाले दृश्य हैं 